Fiancé's family doesn't want my dad to walk me down the aisle. I, 25F, am marrying my fiancé, 29M, in December. One issue has recently arisen and I'm not sure how to handle it. My dad was diagnosed with Parkinson's a couple years ago. It's been rough for our entire family but he's doing well considering. But his shakes have gotten considerably worse over the years. He can still walk but usually only assisted. We've practiced and he'll be able to walk me down the aisle. He's determined to do this for me. For context, my fiancé's family are descendants from some famous British lord or duke. I am not sure on the details. But basically it just means that his family are your very typical upper class. Aristocratic. Conservatives. Especially his grandmother. My fiancé is not like this at all. While we wanted a small destination wedding, his grandmother, the family matriarch, wanted so much that we have a traditional Anglican wedding in England she offered to pay for the whole thing. We agreed because my fiancé loves his grandmother and a free wedding helps our financial situation tremendously. The issue. His grandmother recently saw a video of the actor Michael J. Fox, who also has Parkinson's, and called me in a fury. She asked if my dad had the same condition and I said yes. She immediately said he could not walk me down the aisle because that amount of shaking is unsightly and would ruin the wedding because everyone would be uncomfortable. She said sick people should not be out on display and she doesn't want to embarrass the family. Needless to say I said some not nice things in response. Said I wouldn't be getting married if my dad doesn't walk me and hung up. I told my fiancé and while he agrees what she said was horrible but that it's not worth cancelling. The wedding over and pissing off his grandmother. Who controls the family money? I cannot believe his reaction. I'm at such a loss right now. My dad and fiancé have a great relationship so this is surprising. Is this a valid reason to reconsider my relationship? Please tell me you aren't considering breaking your dad's heart like that for some grumpy old bitch. Just because of money. Hell I'd agree with her and when it comes time. Have dad do it anyway and let her make a big deal of it at the church. Her snobby ass wouldn't dare make a scene. And if she did everyone would be pissed at her. What your fiancé is saying is that free money from the rich family members is more important than your feelings and your family. Do you really want to live your life that way? You say your fiancé is not like everyone else. But this behavior proves he's exactly like the rest of his family. If your fiancé is okay with shuffling off his fill because his disease is unsightly in the name of Lady Grandma Moneybag's wealth, he doesn't deserve a fill. Stand your ground. NTA. Is this a valid reason to reconsider my relationship? I would. You'll be trained monkeys. Doing tricks whenever she mentions money. Yeah, that would be a massive red flag for me. What horrible people. Wanting to deny you and your dad that moment because of optics? A paid-for wedding is worth breaking your dad's heart for in his eyes? Sounds like he's not fallen as far from the tree as you thought. The grandmother is taking advantage of her wants just because she's paying would she have felt the same way if you and your fiancé paid the whole wedding yourselves? I wouldn't let anyone treat my family as lower class based on their health status. I would stick by their side no matter what. This is the only chance your father will have to walk you down the aisle. Don't make a decision that you'll regret. Yeah, I would absolutely reconsider the marriage if his excuse is always going to be, she controls the family money when she oversteps boundaries. I hate having things held over my head like that. Especially money. Your daddy walks you down that aisle or you don't have a wedding it's that simple do not bend on. This issue this will be the hill you die on regardless of what his grandmother thinks. 
You have a lot of self-work to do if you stay with someone that told you your father couldn't walk. You down the aisle because he has Parkinson's. Stop blaming the grandma. Your fiancé is trash and not worth spending your life with. He values money more than love. That's not marriage material. If my father can't walk me down the aisle, it isn't a wedding, and I won't be attending. Set a boundary. Are you sure you wanna get married to this dude? And if he isn't like them at all YTF doesn't he supporting you on this? You don't just marry your fiancé. You marry the whole family. Is that something you want to deal with for the rest of your life? I'd be eloping with your dad as the only guest. What's the plan for future family get-togethers? Is your dad going to exclude it from every holiday because he makes everyone uncomfortable? How about uninvite everyone who has shown they don't have a compassionate bone in their body? He's not like the rest of his family, he sided with his grandma immediately, sure, lol. So you are having a whole wedding you don't want because it's free and helps your financial situation? A small wedding wouldn't have broken the bank. Even if this grandma is paying for it, you are making your family spend money on traveling and getting black tie clothes. Which is very different from cocktail. On top of that, you want to break your dad heart? Your fiancé only cares about money. He doesn't care about you or your family. He is going to do whatever grandma wants until she drops dead just for money. And after grandma dies, then someone else is going to have that role so some other person is going to dictate your life. Probably his parents or an uncle or aunt. My fiancé is not like this at all. He clearly is like that. Wow what a heartless old witch. Keep a spine up. It's your wedding too. It should be under your control. What's embarrassing for them is not embarrassing for you. If you like the idea of your dad walking you down the aisle. Do it. I'd rather be broke and happy doing the minimum than someone paying to do my stuff their way. The problem isn't so much that the grandmother is trying to use money to control you. It's that your partner is letting them. I've seen this so many times and the outcome is extremely predictable. You have two options going forward. First, you can go along with your fiancé's weak-mindedness and obey his shrew of a grandmother. This will surely crush your dad and that wound will always be there. That his daughter would rather have a fancy wedding for free than him walk her down the aisle. Your new grandmother will know that she has you too properly trained and obedient. Anytime she wants to control you. And she most definitely will. She can. Second. You can tell your fiancé that you are not going to allow his grandmother to control you. If she pulls back the money then so be it. You too can make your own way in this world without her and her money. If you take the second option, you need to present a united front and frankly your fiancé needs to take the lead in dealing with them. They are his family after all. If he does not agree to this, I would leave him. He will always be under their control. Is this a valid reason to reconsider my relationship? Yes. Please do reconsider marrying into this family. Your fiancé has met your father and had seen his condition up close. But instead of his grandmother asking him, she calls you and goes off on one? This seems really weird. What is your fiancé's solution to this? To do what she says and have someone else escort you? That's very unkind. Also it does not bode well for the future if he has a view that sickness should be hidden. I have seen family dynamics where there is an elder matriarch or patriarch ruling the family with money and personal power and it never ends well. Especially when they are obsessed with family status like this. Where are your fiancé's parents in all of this? Notably absent from proceedings by the sound of it. Who is your fiancé marrying? You? Or his granny? I suggest cancel the wedding right now so that you minimize the loss to vendors. 
Hand back the engagement ring and cancel the engagement. Up to you whether to keep talking to your fiancé to see if you can go back to your original plan. But that should be with the perspective that you both have premarital counseling. And that he proposes again. Not a flashy proposal btw. I told my fiancé and while he agrees what she said was horrible but that it's not worth cancelling. The wedding over and pissing off his grandmother. Who controls the family money? I cannot believe his reaction. Read what you've written. Your fiancé doesn't want your dad to walk you down the aisle. Either. He'd stand up to his grandmother if he was truly on board with this. His family are tossers, maybe think about what you could be marrying into. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.